Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to play SNES games on your Asus Transformer using your Wiimote. You need your tablet, your Transformer, uh, you need a computer monitor, and you need your mini HDMI cable to HDMI. Just plug that into the back of the monitor. Now you have your Wiimote controller and your Classic Controller Pro, and you're going to obviously hook up your, your uh, Transformer to your computer monitor. Just plug it in, wait a few seconds, It'll pick up the signal. There you go. All set. I like to plug in uh, my speakers so I have better audio. So just plug that into the uh, headphone jack and then you're all set. Um, next step would be to go to the home screen and to go to settings and turn your Bluetooth on. That's the first thing you have to do. Mine's turned on as you can see. Next thing we have to do is go to the uh, Android market and download the uh, Wiimote controller and the SNES OID apps. First one on top left, Wiimote controller. We're just going to click download on that one. Mine's already done, obviously. Next one would be SNES OID. You just look up the first one on top, top left. Uh, download that one as well. Sync your Wiimote with the Wiimote controller app. Just there's a red button on the back. You're gonna press that down for three seconds. Just hold it down for a few seconds and then open your um, Wiimote controller app. And like I said, hold it down. It's gonna start blinking. And then you press the number one option, init and connect. Wait a few seconds. And it should pick up the signal pretty quick. Yeah, it did. So now I tested, it is working. You can see it is communicating and you can also test it on the uh, classic controller like that and it's also working next step in settings you're going to change the input method from keyboard to Wiimote you go to language and input and you select change input method just like that And then you just change it from Asus English Keyboard to Wii Controller IME. That's done. You can open the SNES OID to, to load up the ROM. This is the list of ROMs I have. I downloaded these ROMs, loaded up, and it's working. You can see I have uh, Mario Kart um, all ready to go, but the keys have to be mapped, right, for you to be able to play. So you have to enable Bluetooth on the app you just have to go to settings you have to go to other settings first and then you're gonna have to use input method you see it says Bluetooth gamepad and then you go to input settings and you're gonna uh, uncheck virtual keypad you don't want the virtual keypad because you you actually have a Wiimote controller and a classic controller so now that um, those two are enabled uh, in SNES OID you're gonna be able to map your keys you're gonna go to key mappings and you have all those keys and then you're just gonna have to press each key on the tablet and then on the controller press the same key so you press the up key and then up key on the classic controller down key down key and then after everything is mapped all ready to go you can start playing um, as you can see it's it works just fine you know no problems at all works perfectly this is a, a birthday party that I went to and I brought my Asus transformer and all my setup and everybody was able to play games we can use two emote controllers to play and that's just you know playing Mario Brothers um, it works perfectly. This is a really nice HD TV. You can see that the uh, image quality is superb. So, you know, I hope you guys can do it. Let me know if it works. Um, any doubts, just to please send messages and I will be more than happy to help you. Thank you guys. Have a good one. Cheers.